capturing water at the point of the source and using it at the point of the source really makes a tremendous amount of sense. It's been done uh, throughout time and we're trying to remind people it's a good thing to do environmentally. I'm Scott Cubison. I'm the uh, co-founder and president of Nature's Tap. We're located here in Birmingham. We're focused on rainwater harvesting, gray water reuse, some passive infiltration of water, really anything around water sustainability. You need a rooftop, you need some conveyance in terms of pipes and gutters and whatnot, and you need a tank and you need a filter, uh, and then potentially you need a pump. There are some techniques that are a little more complicated, but it's as simple as putting a rain barrel underneath a downspout, and there's a tremendous amount of water to be captured. Um, a thousand square feet of rooftop with just one inch of rain will produce over 620 gallons of water. And so that water can easily be stored and reused, and we're trying to remind people of the things that they can do, uh, whether it's watering their garden or whether it's flushing their toilets or, or uh, washing their cars, um, washing their dog, whatever you might use uh, other than to, to drink. Uh, and only about 10% of the water we use in a home is used in the kitchen or for drinking water. Well, that's 90% of our water that can be used from rainwater or gray water or recycled water essentially. So what we have here is the filtration system of, that, of this water. So as it comes off the rooftop, it's going to come down through these two gutter systems in this trough and it's going to come right into this vortex filter which is going to create a spinning action and it's got a screen inside that. And so your quality water is then going to come through this pipe to this tank and the trash or any debris that spins out of that vortex is then going to drop down into this area here. It's going to allow you to get quality water into the tank that's easily reusable. And so one inch of rain with a rooftop this size is essentially going to fill up this whole tank. We founded this business in order to, uh, to bring international products and, and, and local products to the market space and provide turnkey solutions. Right around us, there's um, you know, a shortage of water through droughts and things of that nature. So if we can capture water, then uh, there's tremendous energy savings associated with transport of water. It has a positive impact on the watershed and stopping stormwater runoff, and it conserves, wa conserves water that we can use for non-potable use. We wanted to make environmental sense we wanted to make social economic sense and we wanted to make financial sense as well. Where someone can get started for as little as $100 or $200 with a rain barrel and move their way up from there and you can have a complete rainwater harvesting system for just a few thousand dollars or a gray water system for even less than that. The drought we had recently uh, raised a lot of attention to water issues. Um, we have Tennessee, Alabama, Florida um, and Georgia all fighting over, over, over water rights. So clearly um, there's legal battles there's rising costs and trying to build out additional infrastructure. The South is growing. So we've had plentiful water sources and we'll continue to, but we need to make sure that we address them in a smart manner um, to make sure we make use of the resources that we do have.